The main event, baby. There's nothing better than the main event, baby. It is the day we have all been waiting for. The main event is started. It is underway. The crowds are enormous, and people, as we've been speaking about this whole time, are anticipating record numbers for this main event. Now, since there's still a few more days left, I decided to talk to some of the former main event champions in the field about what advice they would give for someone just starting out. Probably just be patient. A lot of people try to win on day one and it's a nine day tournament or whatever. So be patient and have fun. Don't take it too seriously, I guess. The foot many anyway. So for me, I just play like, you know, like for normal. I don't put everything push on me at all. Just like when I came here, just relaxing. When I come, I come. I, 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 do, I just do the best I can. Don't go out too hard. Uh, it's a nine day long tournament, so take it easy, especially in the early levels. Well, Helmuth eating a sandwich like an absolute madman gave us one of the best play-by-play -play calls of the year. Yeah, for those unaware, Phil always eats his food like this. He takes a huge bite, as fast as he can, and then he wraps it up and puts it away. Phil, take your time. What's the rush, man? This or that with my girl, Tiffany Michelle, sounds like exactly what it is. This or that. Okay. Starting with, get slow rolled or get bluffed? Get bluffed. Hero call or get a huge bluff through? Oh, get a huge huge bluff through. GIF or JIF? JIF because it sounds like Jiffy peanut butter. Okay, I go with GIF, it's fine. Wake up alone or with a stranger? With a stranger. Last woman standing or ladies event champ? Oh, wow, Sarah. Wow. I guess it depends on how deep is last woman because I could potentially, I think I made more than how much the ladies event champion made this year, so does it matter much? So it's about how deep Okay, uh, and how much money? La how deep and how much money? And um, and also, if your last woman standing, that could potentially mean like a final table. So last woman standing because it's open for interpretation. Call the clock, or let him Vogel saying it. Or what? What? Vogel saying it? What is that? I'm the, I'm starting this now. Vogel saying it. Is that like he's a poker player? Uh, did he do something? Yeah, he just takes a super super long time oh, to make every decision. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, call the clock. Could do that. Call the clock all day. I knew she was even just that. Especially if you're not in the hand. This or that, Tiffany Michelle, thank you guys so much. Norman Chad gave his thoughts on the Helmuth rail last night. He said, we have jumped the shark in poker in so many ways. The rail, and when I say the rail, I mean a handful of people at the WSP 3K freeze out was over the top unacceptable. A lot of it brought on by the presence of Phil Helmuth, but two wrongs do not make a right. Has the poker brat conducted himself improperly and repeatedly at the poker table? Yes, which is no excuse as some people in the gallery now treat him, or the game. Sure, fans in the stands heckle in all sports, but we need to be better. Yeah, there was a lot of words being thrown around at Helmuth last night. Um, he handled it well, but the environment, it was pretty ruthless. the former main event champion, current reigning main event champion, Karai Aldemir. Tell me a little bit how different it feels approaching this year's World Series of Poker as the champion versus coming in last year. For multiple reasons. First of all, I'm getting recognized more. Also, just the fact that I won it. I mean, a lot of people ask me if I have more pressure. I feel like I have less pressure, kind of. I don't, I don't know. You know. For those who might be approaching their first main event as the champion, what tips or advice would you give to them? Yeah, I always say it depends on, on, on the goal, basically. If, if you're in it for, for fun, then just enjoy yourself, have, have fun, try to have a good time. Of course, if you want to make a lot of money, then maybe try to not focus on what's on the line, but to just play your best like you would in every other tournament. And if you're just playing for fun and it's $10,000, <laughs> Good for you, keep your day job. And we got a tweet from Anton Wig. He says, half stacked guy at my table was just informed there is no rebuy in the main. He is not happy about it. Hashtag, this is the main event. Yes, this is the main event. One chance, one bullet and a dream. Phil Helmuth tweeted, still recovering from the last two days, 12 hours of intense no limit hold'em. Finished in second place. We'll take tomorrow off. Meanwhile, I'm coming in a costume for the WSP main event on Tuesday, as he does every year. Which costumed Phil do you like? Superman, Apex Predator, or King Kong? All right, well, let me know down below what you guys wanna see. Personally, 
I want to see King Kong. Today marks the spot where we are one day closer to crowning our next WSOP main event champion. So I decided to find out who's your favorite main event champion. Probably. Wow, I screwed up. Um, uh, probably Martin Jacobson. Martin Jacobson. I think he's just so nice. Really great kid. Gosh, I think my favorite main event winner would have to be. My favorite main event champion is Kui Wen. Martin Jacobson. I'm more obligated to say Joe McKeon because he's the only one I actually like know personally and he'll probably give me shit if I don't say him. So great job, Joe. Johnny Chan winning two years in a row and then getting second to help you the thing at Rounders. I mean, I just think that's probably the coolest main event whenever. He had the cool like track suit and just looked sweet with the big sunglasses and that was back before they had the whole card. So I'm gonna go with Johnny Chan. I think that's the coolest main event winner ever.